What's going on everybody? Welcome to Clutch Moment Gaming. I'm your host Cody Clutch and welcome to Madden 17 Franchise Mode with the Green Bay Packers. We're in our second week of the 2018 season. Gonna be playing the Miami Dolphins in this one at uh, apparently their new Miami Stadium is what they're calling it. So I'm excited to play at it. Um, we are 0-1. That is correct. We already have a loss and it's week two. We lost against the Rams in our previous video. If you have not got a chance to watch that video, make sure to go back and watch that one because it kind of sets up the season, uh, sets up uh, the 2018 season basically. So make sure if you have not went and watched that, make sure to go ahead and do that. But hopefully we're looking to redeem ourselves in this game. Um, Dolphins 0-1 as well, so hopefully we'll be able to come out with an easy win. Not necessarily easy since we're playing away, but uh, we're going to we're gonna hope and pray anyway. Let's get to the game. What's going on everybody? Welcome to uh, Miami where we're going to be playing the Miami Dolphins here in this one. I'm excited for this game. Um, always fun to play the Dolphins. I haven't played them in a while to be honest with you. I don't really, don't really think of them as a team to play uh, as or against as well. So hopefully we'll, we'll still be able to come out with a win in this one. Uh, Alrighty, it looks like Ryan Tannehill coming into the game. 258 yards, 2 TDs, 0 interceptions on the season so far. So not too shabby of a year for his first game. Let's see what he can do in the second one. We'll set up Shab at the 25-yard line for a first and 10. I'm excited for this game. It should be good. I'm, I'm really excited. Dropping back. Let's see what he can do. Found a guy over the middle. And that's going to be a first down. Not wasting any time whatsoever. I'm going to go pass. I think that's what it's going to be. Ryan Tannehill, pretty good quarterback. Have to watch out for him in this game. Ooh, there we go. Run game getting bunched up in the backfield. Going to lose some yards. Two to be exact. Setting up second and 12 at the 34. I want to let you guys know, too, uh, for my MLB franchise uh, with the Chicago Cubs. Going to be having a video out soon, so no worries on that one. Stay tuned. Um, I'm just basically, what I'm doing is uh, playing each game in the series, uh, so like we just got done playing the Cardinals, and uh, I, there's three games in the Cardinals series, and so I played all those, and I'm going to mash it up into one video, so that way you guys never miss a moment of uh, every game, so... Let me know if you guys uh, have any other way of me doing it. I don't know if that's the best option right now, but if there is, let me know in the comment section below of this video or my MLB video where I first used my PS4. All right, run game going here. McDougal getting a rush there, setting up a second and two at the 41 now. I want to ask you guys, what did you think about the uh, NFL draft and who the Packers picked up? All defensive guys and uh, traded out of a first round to get two second rounders. What did you guys think of their uh, their idea on that? Did you guys watch any of the interviews about the players or anything like that? I know I didn't. I didn't really have time to do that. Just kind of went with a quick overview, read how the player was, what he uh, was capable of, that kind of thing, and how he should be. Um, but, I mean, you never know. I mean, you just have to wait until they play the game because... Some players are not very, they're not drafted very high, but end up being great players. And you never know if that might just happen with uh, one of the Packer players. So it's just something you have to watch out and see. I'm hoping that our defense will be good this year. I'm excited for it. Um, I mean, picking up, it's going to be a young defense. Clay Matthews in the reins of it, but I'm, I'm just excited for the season. As long as we can keep out of the injury bug, we should be good to go. Man, Dolphins are throwing all over us, using every inch of the field on this drive. Dolphins are knocking on the door, that is for sure. Going with the run game, not going to get anywhere. It'll be third and two at the 10-yard line. All right, welcome to the second quarter already. Seems like this video just started, which it did. And uh, Dolphins taking up a lot of clock on this drive. He's going to get the first. Went with the option, didn't know what it was going to be. It wasn't really much of an option, more of just a nice handoff. Going blitz. Let's see what we can do. Ooh, there we go Went with the uh, run game again, spinning, but going to be tackled before the goal line. Throwing goal now at the three. 
on third. I have a feeling, oh man, I don't know if they're going to go pass over the top of us right now or if they're just going to run it up the middle. I'm going to guess pass as Tannehill's in shotgun. Nope, it's run, and we stopped it. There we go. Nice, good job. Blitz paid off, apparently. Alrighty, we're going to be at the 25-yard line for a first and 10. 2.45 left to go in the second quarter. And we're just now getting the ball. That's kind of interesting, isn't it? Hopefully we can get a nice pass game going. I'm going to try to anyway. Jordy Nelson going to get a first down there. Nice. That's what I like to see. Hopefully we don't turn out like our last game. Throw a lot of interceptions. Not that, Not something I want to do. That was a bad game that I kind of want to forget about. It wasn't one of my highlight games by any means. There we go. Got it over to Nelson. Nelson uh, getting another first down there. Two minute warning going to hit here. All right. It'll be first and 10 at the 47 yard line. Two minutes left to go in this first half. Oh, there we go. Got it over to Nelson once again. Nelson picking up another first down. Not talking too much on this offensive series as I really want to score. I don't want to throw an interception. And just how tough it is to cover tight ends, especially the ones running around the NFL nowadays. Makes me glad I didn't make it in that league. I would have had a really difficult time. There we go. Got it over to Cook once again. Yeah, and that's fun. There we go. That was Montgomery. Never mind. Montgomery becoming a big part in this offense, as in, if you guys remember in the last video, Cobb got injured out for the season. So Montgomery definitely going to have to step in and try to be a factor for the pack. Oh, man, that was almost intercepted. Wow. Try to get a quick throw off there to Montgomery in the middle. Now going to pay off. All right, second and goal at the eight-yard line. This is where I kind of stumble up a little bit. Hopefully we can get a touchdown still here. I'm going to run with it. Let's go, let's go, let's go, Rodgers. Oh, he's going to get a touchdown. Touchdown, Packers. Aaron Rodgers with the rushing touchdown. There we go. <laughs> No one open. Why do I throw a pick? I don't know. Let's just rush it with Rodgers. There we go. Taking it himself. Not finding anyone after about four seconds of great blocking up front and finding our way into the end zone for that touchdown. There we go. That's what I like to see. All right. Dolphins taking their first timeout. 40 seconds left to go. Third and six at the 29 now for them. Ooh, bad pass by Tannehill. Don't know where he was throwing with that one. So fourth and six. We'll get the ball back here. All right. So we'll have it first and ten at the 47-yard line. 26 seconds left. All three timeouts we have. See what I want to do. There we go. Going to pass to Montgomery. Montgomery, my favorite play. And he's going to score a touchdown off it. Touchdown, Packers. Ty Montgomery. There we go. Filling in for Randall Cobb. And he's coming to play. That is what I want to see out of him the rest of this season. And hopefully, hopefully we can see that. So, awesome job by Montgomery. And we'll get the ball in the second half as well. So, clear sailing for us so far in this first half. Alrighty, welcome back to the game, boys and girls. Now in the second half here, we got the ball at the 31-yard line for a first and 10. 14-3 ball game. See what else we can get going here. Ooh, nice spin by Gurley. Gurley taking some uh, players with him. Jones going with him. First rush of the game for him, 16 yards. Better have to do more of that, I guess. Alright, so instead of uh, second and about five, it's going to be first and 20 at the 37. Holding penalty didn't help whatsoever. There we go. Got over to Nelson to the left side. Not going to get a first down, but uh, chipping into that holding penalty. So second and nine at the 47. He can hurt you downfield. He reads defense so well, doesn't he? He really does, and the best part about that play for him. Ooh, there we go. Got a nice pass over to Montgomery, or is that? Oh, that's Cook. Never mind. That's Cook over the middle there. It's hard to decipher between the numbers, the 89 and the 88. <laughs> All right, so first and 10 at the 24-yard line. Just over two minutes left to go in this first or uh, third quarter, excuse me. Oh, there we go. Oh, man. Oh, almost had a touchdown with Nelson there. Not quite going to get it. I'm going to be at the two-yard line here. All right, let's go ahead and go pass again. You know me pretty well. What do you think I want here? 
play action. Definitely. Let him get outside and create. And if he has to run it, he has a little bit more space. Oh, nice deflection there. Nelson not able to hold on to that one-handed grab. All right, so it'll be third and goal at the two-yard line. 105 left to go in the third quarter here. Going to go pass. Runs not likely an option. Oh, man. Oh, Spriggs, you got a block for me, buddy. Oh, man. Fourth and goal. Gosh. Just about ready to run with that Rodgers there. Alrighty, so the Dolphins going to have it at the 24-yard line for a first and 10. 30 seconds left to go in the third quarter here of this ball game. Let's see what we can do. Going run. Oh, there we go. Clinton Dix coming in there, stopping McDougal there. It'll be second and eight at the 26-yard line for the Dolphins here just in the first quarter. Or, uh, first play of the fourth quarter here. Oh, there we go, interception. There we go, that's what I like to see. I couldn't even get words out of my mouth. That was such a weird interception. It was either Dix or uh, Randall there, and Randall comes up with a one-handed grab. Let's look at this replay. Oh, man, just right into his arm. He's like, yes, I will take that. Oh, I guess he had a double catch on that, or two-handed catch on that. My bad. I thought it was just a one-handed catch. Ball somehow went into his hand, but not quite. All right, so we can take it nice and slow here, uh, not have to rush anything. We're up 17 to 3, so we should be good to go. Oh, there we go. Nice catch. Oh, not going to be caught by Cook there, I think. Urban 6 at the 42-yard line, 421 left to go in the ball game. Oh, there we go. Got it over to Nelson to the left side there. Getting a nice first down and some rack yardage there for him as well. All right, third and nine at the 20 yard line for the pack. Let's see if we can convert another first down. Gonna try. See if it can happen. There we go, got over to Nelson for a touchdown Packers. Jordy Nelson. First receiving TD of the ball game, having himself a great game against this Dolphins defense. Alrighty, so Packers coming to play in this ball game. 24 to 3 is your score. 337 left to go in the ball game here. Kind of muscle. I kind of wanted redemption after that first game because man, we came to play. Wow. On second and ten, Tannehill. And now he lost the football. Tannehill loses it. Oh, there we go. Matthews coming up with the fumble there. Sweet. Yeah, I was focused in. I was like, is that a fumble or is that a deflection that we could intercept? I didn't know what it was. But Matthews coming up with his first fumble recovery of the of the season so far. So nice job staying with the play. Play till the whistle. That is correct. Hopefully he can pick up that one yard and maybe even a touchdown. Let's try it. There we go, picking up the touchdown. That's Todd Gurley via the run game. Touchdown, Packers. Todd Gurley. There we go, buddy. That is what I like to see out of you. All righty. Dolphins going to have the ball at the 23-yard line for a first and 10. 219 left to go in the ball game here. 31-3 is your score right now, so kind of just racking up. Oh my gosh, it is an interception. Oh man, nothing is going right for the Dolphins. Oh my goodness. Wow. What a great game for us offensively and defensively. So we'll have it first and 10 at the 20-yard line now. Oh man, oh my. This is a crazy game compared to last one. On first down, it's Gurley. All right, third and goal, three, two, one, and that's the end of the ball game. Packers coming out here with a win, absolutely destroying the Miami Dolphins, three-one to three for your final score of this ball game. Wow, that was a complete show the whole time. Whew, that was it. That was that was some good dolphin hunting right there. Very good dolphin hunting. Yeah, I, I, we, man, they just came out with a will to win in this game after we lost week one versus the Rams. We were not going to lose this game. I could just see it in everyone's faces. And uh, even though it's a video game, but still, I had fun playing this game. Hopefully you guys had fun watching it. And uh, hopefully stay tuned for my next video 
Um, hopefully it's a Ma um, MLB 17 franchise mode with the Chicago Cubs video, but if it's not, look out for uh, for more videos and uh, for whatever I decide to get up for you guys. So if you like this video, make sure to hit that like button. And if you have not subscribed to Clutch Moment Gaming and you like this Packer content, football, Madden 17, anything you want to call it, soccer, you can even call it soccer, I don't know. <laughs> If you guys like my kind of content on this channel, make sure to subscribe if you have not done so today. And uh, also right next to the subscribe button is that little bell icon. So every time I put a video out, it'll send you an email and notify you via YouTube. So that way you would never miss a video that comes out on my channel. So thank you guys so much for watching. For Clutch Moment Gaming, I'm Cody Clutch. Hope you guys have a great, great day. I'll catch you guys next video. Peace.